A truck driver dazed and in danger. His cab caught fire after a head on crash. Luckily, a heroic deputy was there to save him from the flames. That deputy is now receiving some high honors. WCCO's Jason Rantala has the story. Kind of like a, like a movie scene. It wasn't even really real at the time. This was that scene. Washington County Sheriff's Deputy Chris Majeski came upon back in June. 1313 trying to execute one. A fiery crash, the result of a wrong way driver on I-94 in the overnight hours, not far from Hudson, Wisconsin. The drunk driver died. And I could see uh, one person in the semi. The other driver inside a semi, unconscious. Some yelling for his attention. Get out of the vehicle, quick, come on! With an engulfed truck and fumes filling the air. I could kind of taste on the back of my palate of my mouth. And that fuel leaking toward the fire. Time was in essence to get this guy out of this car. Hurry Deputy Majeski knew he had to act quick. Come on, come on over, quick, this way, sir, this way. With the driver going in and out of consciousness. I'm gonna drag you to my car. Majeski pulled the man towards his squad car. I kind of went over the media and I grabbed him, but with one hand, my other hand, and I dragged him over the median. While doing so, now the passenger okay. compartment of the semi is completely engulfed in fire. Eventually, getting him out of That's harm's way. Thankfully, the ambulance came, they brought him to the hospital and made a complete recovery. Deputy Majeski, it is with great pride that I can present you with this Medal of Valor Award. The deputy receiving a high honor. It's the highest award you can get. From the Sheriff's Office this fall. <laughs> Majeski says it's all thanks to his training both as a deputy and volunteer firefighter and happening to be in the right place at just the right time. It all worked out for the best to get that guy out in the manner we did. In Stillwater, Jason Rantala, WCCO News. The driver only suffered a concussion. Deputy Majeski received more honors earlier this week. He received a life-saving award from the Minnesota Sheriff's Association.